Hi guys, welcome to Tune Basics, the series that teaches you how to play the basics. Today, we'll be learning how to play Twinkle Twinkle Little Star by Wolfgang Amadeus Mozart around 1781 on the penny whistle, also known as the tin whistle. Here is a penny whistle. This penny whistle is in the key of C. But don't worry if yours isn't in the key of C, because for this lesson, it is the finger holes that are important. When holding your penny whistle, remember that your left hand is positioned closest to your mouth and uses fingers 1, 2, and 3 to cover holes 1, 2, and 3. The right hand is positioned so that fingers 4, 5, and 6 can cover holes 4, 5, and 6. For these lessons, when you see a blue arrow pointing into the mouthpiece, this means blow gently enough to still produce notes. When you see a red arrow pointing into the mouthpiece, this means blow a bit harder to produce a higher note. So let's get straight into it. Here's what Twinkle Twinkle Little Star looks like when the notes are written down in the key of C. You'll notice that I've broken it up into five phrases, but that phrases four and five are exactly the same as phrases one and two. Here's what it sounds like. C, C, G, G, A, A, G, F, F, E, E, D, D, C, G, G, F, F, E, E, D, G, G, F, F, E, E, D, C, C, G, G, A, A, G, F, F, E, E, D, D, C. Now let's take a closer look at phrase one. First, cover all six holes with fingers one to six and blow gently twice. Then, cover holes one and two with fingers one and two and blow gently twice. Now, cover hole one with finger number one and blow gently twice. And finally, cover holes one and two with fingers one and two and blow gently once. And hopefully, you'll end up with something that sounds like this. For the second phrase, you'll need to cover holes 1, 2, and 3 with fingers 1, 2, and 3 and blow gently twice. Then, cover holes 1 to 4 with fingers 1, 2, 3, and 4 and blow gently twice. Now, cover holes 1 to 5 with fingers 1, 2, 3, 4, and 5 and blow gently twice. Cover all six holes with fingers 1 to 6 and blow gently once. And after some practice, you'll end up with something like this. For the third phrase, cover holes 1 and 2 with fingers 1 and 2 and blow gently twice. Then cover holes 1 to 3 with fingers 1 to 3 and blow gently twice. Now cover holes 1 to 4 with fingers 1 to 4 and blow gently twice. And finally, Cover holes 1 to 5 with fingers 1, 2, 3, 4, and 5 and blow gently once. And after some practice, you should be able to play it like this. Now after phrase 3, you then repeat phrases 1 and 2 again, which are exactly the same as phrases 4 and 5. So there's no need to go over them again now. Once you've learned how to play these five phrases separately, try putting them all together. And there you have it. So thank you for watching, and please don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. And also, please check out some of my other lessons. And until next time, stay tuned. See ya.